How's it going, everybody? My name's Sugar Cat, and welcome back to House Flipper. It feels good to do that intro again. Look, the ears are back. I love it. And a happy 4th of July to all my American viewers down south. I hope you're not melting to death. I'm trying not to. We are in the middle of a terrible heat wave right now. It is both 37 Celsius at 11 a.m. So I might melt. I might just melt into a big pool of ice cream right in the middle of my chair, right in the middle of this video. You guys might be in for a very good show. Somebody mentioned in my comments, they're like, what is this guy doing with this shed in the middle of this nice looking neighborhood? And I thought about it for a second and I'm like, how? How did this happen in this neighborhood? I have no idea, but we're going to get answers. I got to clean this door off at some point in time. We're just going to amass a whole ton of money first before we start dealing with this place. I'd like to get a few things done in here in today's episode. We're going to clean this up because this place is looking awful shoddy. We're at least going to clean up the... That's not even dirt, is it? That's just paint. That's just paint peeled off the walls. We have to get rid of stuff like this. So, can I sell that? Someone bought my old dirty poster. Alright, buy all my dirty posters. I want to... Yeah, get rid of this crap. Who needs this? Get rid of all this. Get rid of all this. I don't need... Can I get rid of that spoon? I can. Buy my spoon! Buy my door! Buy my bed! Buy my rug! Buy everything! Buy, buy, buy! Sell, sell, sell! Yeah, I need the laptop. I don't need any of this crap. I, pr I probably do. Wait, does this mean I'm not gonna have anything to do any renovations with? Nah, I'm sure that's not what it means at all. We're gonna fix this up. Sell that. I don't need that. Sell that. I don't need that either. Sell this too. Sell this too. Oh, look at this! Look at the progress we're making! In real life, this <laughs> this is legitimately all that I need. <laughs> oh no, that makes me kind of sad. Okay, I've made a decision. I made an executive decision. We're going to wait to paint inside of here until you guys tell me what colors you want me to paint it. Now, here's your choice of colors. Under paints. You got black, moody cobalt, icy blue, sleepy blue, Purple Lily, Pistachio Green, Heavy Green, Heavy Green, maybe like a Forest Green, Gray Fog, Azure Bliss, Indigo, Purple Quartz, Navy Blue Light, Cocoa, Amaranth Adventure, Bloody Red, Gray, Ripe Pear, Roll Blue, Sky Blue, Lime, Coffee with Milk, Mmm, Bright Lavender, Alluring Lavender, Spring Grass, Sunny Yellow, Sand Elm, Pastel Pink, Red, Fiery Orange, Laughing Strawberry, Laughing Strawberry, Mandarin Orange, Pink Velvety Peach, Sunny Orange, Bright Peach, Morning Yellow, Faded Lemon, and White. So you guys let me know in the comments, the color with the most votes will win the competition, and it's the color that we will paint our lovely living room. And if you want, we can do our little office area here, and our bedroom, and our living room, and different colors, until we expand the house, and... No, can't do that yet. Until we expand the house and get a bigger house we're going to deal with what we have so for now let's get some more money because we're going to need it thomas johnson additional walls i need some alterations made to my two-room house my daughter's now three and we feel it's time that she had her own room please divide the bedroom into two rooms and make sure the new rooms both have doors that connect to the corridor could you please also put in the new bed and remove the crib that sounds like a nice easy job let's accept that in the house of a real man is no place for children's toys I beg to differ. All right, Mr. Man, what do you got going on here? It's in here. What is this? This is a closet? Oh, I gotcha. They want to smash down the closet room and separate this area into two separate rooms. Oh, it's not that bad. I can do that. I'll do it. What pow? I should have probably took the furniture out first before starting this, but you know what? We do what we got to do. We got to smash some walls in. And when you're smashing walls in, you don't take time to consider the little details. You just smash. You smash things. This would be a great job. Oh my. I would love to have this job. If I was more physically adept at swinging a giant 20 pound hammer, I would love this job. What do you do all day? I just break things. I just break big walls all day. Look at that. It's beautiful. Except for this piece. Get out of here, wall. No one wants you here. Nice. Okay, let's sell this crib. Boop. I guess we can just leave her stuff. Here, let's move this oh crap i actually gotta pick up i don't gotta pick up all oh, i gotta pick up each of these individually i would have just left the bureau there i would have known that but when you're doing a job you do it right i'm probably gonna have to do this again actually because i don't like where that bureau is that bureau is in a silly place okay so i guess what we can do is just build wall does that work why yes indeed it does 
All right. I mean, you don't just put brick in the middle of a house, do you? It's usually just like boards and not brick. Don't ask me what I'm doing. I, do, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm talking about. I talk about building houses like I know exactly what I'm doing. I don't have any idea what I'm doing. A house is where I keep my fridge and my computer. A house is also where I sit in to boil in front of said computer all day. It is so hot in here. <laughs> so hot in here but i am motivated i am motivated to get a children's bedroom done you know what i should have given the parents less room actually parents don't need any room what are the parents gonna need room for whatever parents do parent things there we go isn't that pretty now if this was me i'd keep the brick finish because i actually really like the brick finish but you know they're gonna what's a lintel Okay, well, I have no idea what a lintel is, so we'll ignore that for now. Uh, is it just gray? Can I just paint brick? No, you can't. You can't just paint brick, can you? Is this the right color? It's not, is it? Nope. What color is that? No, it's not white. Is it? Yeah, it is. It's just white. You can't just paint brick like this. It doesn't work that way. When in doubt, go to the Sugar Cat School of Painting. Where we'll teach you just to paint on top of brick like this. So I hope all of you are having an awesome day so far if you're american i hope you're being safe look at that look at that oh my god it's amazing i don't like where this is we're gonna put this over here even though it's gonna make all the toys fall on the floor we'll just go pick them up it'll be fine it'll be fine why didn't none of these things look straight all right mr bunny welcome to your new bedroom boop, boop. now we're gonna place the bed under the window yeah yeah that looks much better much better but we're gonna move this over to here because no one wants to play with their tea sets and stuff in the middle there like that. Just go like this. Boop. And then take this and put this over here. Maybe not in front of the door because that's a tripping hazard. And then we're going to pick up said chair and put this chair. No, I like it better like right here. There. What are those red lines? Just installing some plugs. Nothing, nothing of any monumental concern. Beauty. Oh, the other wall's not painted. <laughs> <laughs> the wall's not in the right place. Remember what I said about the wall probably being one more into the parents' bedroom? That's what it was. I was totally wrong. I completely goofed. I mean, this won't cost me much, will it? Get out of here, dresser. The wall's going in the right place now, don't worry. Now nah, I'm sad. I thought I was doing a great job. But you know what? It's all about staying motivated. Let's stay motivated. Nothing's wrong. Everything's fine. I'm a little bit worried that it says I haven't put the bed, considering that I have the bed down. You know, they could have at least made their bed before the handyman came over. So let's sell our paint. The wall is complete. I need to replace something in here. Hello. There. All the sockets are complete. Now all we got left is this bed, which for some reason they don't like. Oh, that's completely different. Yeah, let's go with that. I like that. So good. She's going to love it. Look at it. It's beautiful. As a kid, I would love that room. Are we done? We're done. <laughs> We're all done. But that was a good amount of money. That was like five grand. All right, that took a lot longer than I expected. I'm going to end this episode here for now because I don't want to get heat stroke while I'm building houses. I mean, this guy wouldn't be tearing down walls and building houses in this kind of heat. And neither should I. So for now, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you hit the like and subscribe button down below. Have a happy 4th of July. Keep being awesome. And I will see all of you in the next video.